I think all science starts as science fiction. Now by this, I don't mean science fiction authors drive society. What I mean is every piece of science starts off with the scientists going, what if? So all science starts off with imagination. There is, of course, a symbiotic relationship between science and science fiction. In the 50s, Collier's Magazine did this series of articles called Man Will Conquer Space Soon. They commissioned these artists to do these beautiful drawings and paintings of people going to the moon, going to Mars, presenting it actually not as like way out there nutty ideas, but saying, you know, this is something we can accomplish. And, and that drew a ton of public support into Behind the Space program. The joy of science fiction is that it can generate curiosity and it can generate an idea idea of what is possible. And we're very good as a species at taking something that says, ooh, maybe we could do this, and then someone finds a way to do it. As you have people who are growing up with science fiction, with visions of the future, that becomes the template for a possible future for them. Things become thinkable that would not have been thinkable otherwise. On the mark, get set. We're riding on the internet, cyberspace, set free. Hello, virtual reality. 